Hey guys, what is up? This is Vulture here today, and as you saw from the title, um, I saw a few YouTubers do this, thought it was pretty fun, but uh, yeah, you get past the gameplay, it is combat training online, so there is real people, um, I, I went like 51 or something, it's not about the gameplay really, I just wanted to get something to have a background for. Um, if these videos start getting popular, if I start doing stuff like this and they start getting popular, I'll put more, a lot more effort into it, but uh, you know, I just wanted to throw up a video today, and I thought this was a very good, fun idea, but basically, it is called Urban Dictionary. Now, Urban Dictionary is a, um, basically, the word, like, it's slang words, basically, it's like, um, uh, what, what's a, what's a good word that's not, oh, thought, you know, it's a hoe word, you know, that's urban, that's like, you talk to your friends, like, oh, yeah, she a, like, oh, yeah, she a thought, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's, it's that type of shit, not to sound racist, but it's like, it's, I don't know, check the motherfucking website out, I'm pretty sure y'all heard of it, but anyways, it's an app, you can download it on your phone, tablet, computer, not computer probably, and they have a randomizer button, so you get randomizer, random words, so basically I'm gonna read a couple off, um, not a couple, but a lot, cause it is quite, hold up, excuse this, yeah, it's about 10 minutes long, so we got a bunch of time, you, um, um, you might learn something, you might find a word, you might use it with your friends. I don't know, it could go any way you want, really. You might have a little laugh. Uh, I don't know. And if there's echoing, I'm so sorry for that. Uh, I'll work on it. But yeah, let's get the, the the first word. The first word is snowflake. And now, y'all know what a snowflake is. This is just for example. Now, the definition of a snowflake in Urban Dictionary. And let it be known, you can scroll down and find out other... Um, other uh, definitions for each word, so there might it might have multiple meanings. But yeah, anyways, a snowflake is a person who thinks they are on Gwinnikim, but it's in fact just like a, oh, it's like a person that um, I don't know, girl next door. She's the girl who's right for you, and she's been right under your nose the whole time. It's so obvious, and you never want to ruin her because she's perfect girl for you. So the girl next door. Um, yeah, we. I'm gonna read every word off. There's gonna be no restrictions, and I know on Urban Dictionary you can get a little PG. Uh, PG-18, when you say this. So I'm going to word every word out. Um, this is a... Uh, if it does get that way, I don't know how this is going to go. But, uh, yeah. Uh, viewer discretion is advised if you're under 18, you know. Get out of the video. Click it. I'm going to make it age restricted if I do get some some bad words. But, yeah. Get out of the video. Um, but, yeah. We have... Um, the next word is rubber. And I'm pretty sure I know what this is. It's a natural occurring substance that is basis from most lead tape products, although synthetics are become more and more common. AM slang, condom, pencil eraser. Yeah, it's a rubber rubber is basically a condom. <laughs> a ball sack. A being that tells you what to do between the hours of 9 a.m. and 5 p.m., also known as a boss. <laughs> so, uh, another word for your boss. And then we have ZZZ, which is basically like you're tired, I guess. And the definition is terms used when something bothers you. Oh, yeah. Homework sucks. Z z z z really z z z. Oh. <laughs> All right, let me refresh it again. There's some stupid ones. All right, small and freedom. The joy of falling into a depth in small increments. A somewhat douchey attempt at a viral marketing campaign by Visa involving created Twitter accounts, Urban Dictionary entries, a history of small freedom video, a creepy hockey commercial, and being generally pretentiously mysterious. The word is loan word only in s what the fuck? All right, guardian angel, a person who is always looking out for you. I was upset, but my guardian angel was there to come for me. Slang used in the U.S. Navy for woman used by all or woman with unusually big asses. So wuba, w u b a, um, I guess. All right. A train, t r a n g, a Vietnamese girl with freckless. Freckles on both sides of her face to be cute and enthusiastic, smart, loves volleyball. She is so trang, I think I have a crush on her. Look at this shy baby, she's... <laughs> Alright, now we have a Republican, basically the opposite of the Democrat. Um, now let's see Urban Dictionary's um, definition for this. A person that has an utter disrespect for moral values, <laughs> definitely raping the economy for their own benefit in order to squander as much personal profit as possible. Oh. <laughs> XD, a laughing face, obviously. A rice, or rice. All show, no go. Modifying a car that is a piece to begin with and doing nothing but bodywork to its in the end, but most likely loud and unbearable. Look at that piece. How much money do you think he put in that race? A race is basically, you know them really loud cars that drive past you that are mostly drive by teenagers and they drive past you. 
And I got the stickers and shit. Oh yeah, by the way, stickers add horsepower, guys. Remember that in life. If you ever get a car, get some aftermarket stickers that you don't own the parts, slap them on your windshield, back windshield, whatever you want. Bam, that's like five horsepower. Or if you live in somewhere else, BHP. You know, that's, like, you put enough stickers on your car, you'll be uh, packing some horses. And uh, yeah, basically, yeah, I'm pretty sure I know what a ricer is, but... Let me find the uh, Fox News. <laughs> no, that's too long. Yeah, let me refresh it again. Beating. A chick who has high maintenance, better than you, attitude, and acts like you aren't worth her time. A chick who nags and is controlling in a relationship. Or origin San Diego. Dude, that chick is a, such a beating. She won't let John come to the movies with us because she thinks he'll go picking up on other girls. <laughs> Gaping? <laughs> Nah, <laughs> y'all can know where that's going. <laughs> oh, that's way too long. Whoa. <laughs> AOL disc, a flat circular object with a hole in the middle that is sent out by the billions by AOL about every six seconds in an attempt to convert everyone to the same shitty ISP. Yeah, it's <laughs> soda, a word commonly used in civilized areas to refer to a sweet carbonated beverage. Brown, a brown shower. This should be interesting. <laughs> brown showers re refer to a partners who defecate on one another. This may be done using enema some of which may consist of diluted wine or food. Her love laid beneath her while she poured a brown shower upon him. This was the fourth rip, the ultimate baptism. <laughs> College, the place where you enter an exorbitant amount of depth to learn things you will never apply once to your actual- Wait, this is real school, but anyways, basically an expensive four-year waiting period for a rapper paper cod degree. I will owe Wells Fargo my first born so I can pay off my college. Uh, let's see. Sport, a game being developed by Max no. Minna. Name of a saint in the Coptic Orthodox religion, a very popular name for Egyptian males. See, you learned something. Alright, sex pod. A sexy hot person, not someone who necessarily likes sex all the time, although she might, but one who just is freaking hot. So, a sex pod. There you go, you learned something, you little <laughs> 30, 12 year old. Just starting to know what it does. <laughs> Road rave. When you. Two road rave. When two drivers appreciate each other's navigation skills so much, they end up dancing together in the street to shitty music. Oh, <laughs> road rave. <laughs> I mean, if you ever had a road rave, please tell me because I would. I'm actually. I'm at the end of this video. I'm gonna search it up on YouTube. See if I can. <laughs> oh, I found one. It was like cornhole. It's like when <laughs> you sit on the toilet, like you make a cornhole after eating corn. <laughs> it's so stupid. Right, hold up. Pregnant, carrying the developing offspring within the butt. Oh, yeah, that's obvious. Honey bunches of oats. My anti drug. Hey, man, I want to shoot some heroin. No way, bro. I just bought a new box of honey bunches of oats. <laughs> Burnout, a high school or college student who does little else than cut classes and smoke weed usually has long straight hair and cr Wait, I had long straight hair and I didn't do any of this. And toward heavy metal bands of the 70s and oh yeah, that explains. Can often be found in smoke filled bathrooms and makeshift basement bars. Bowl. The intensive Oh yeah, it's a merit it's an I'll pack that bowl, yeah. It's like it's a pipe. For marijuana, basically, and you know, use it for tobacco. You can use it whatever the hell you want. All right, blaze, smoke weed every day. We already know that. And my friends are hitting on my kick right now. Betch. Oh my god, Becky, you're such a bitch. Oh, hold, let's see if I can do my girl voice. Hey guys, what's up? This is Vulture, and today I just wanted to like talk to you about something, and maybe we can like you know get together. But no, Becky is such a bitch. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah. It's basically another word for bitch, but let me read the definition of, uh, yeah, y'all didn't hear that. I, yeah, no. Term used to typically by Kelly, stop kicking me. Term used typically by Kelly for stupid whores who like shoes and other people's tops too much. Uh, dubstep, a genre, yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all know what dubstep is. 
All right, let me get a good one before the. Oh no, it's over! Oh no! Oh no! All right, guys. Well, hey, if y'all uh, enjoyed this, you learned something, then hit that like button, kapow pow, and uh, yeah, kapow that like button. Uh, I actually kind of enjoy making these. I'll uh, make a make you know a good one. I'll uh, actually edit it. Only find good words an immature twelve year old that plays Call of Duty would like. Well, some adults they might like them. Um, you know, you can actually learn something from this, you know, you can actually, you know, I, I'll throw a couple, um, words in there that might, uh, uh, you know, help you out, but, um, yeah, guys, Vulture, go ahead, drop a subscribe if you thought it was necessary, because uh, I'm going to be uploading this, comment if you like this, like if you liked it, made you giggle, made you learn a new word, but yeah, guys, Vulture X. Sorry that I'm such a talkative person. <laughs> Beg to disagree.